During last night's edition of WHKY TV News, we reported on the 19th COVID-19 related death in Burke County. The individual was in their 70s and had underlying medical issues. In addition, 10 new cases of COVID-19 were confirmed yesterday in Catawba County, increasing the total to 480 with 13 deaths. There were 14 people still in the hospital with COVID-19 as of yesterday. Here in Caldwell County, the highest number of cases in one day was reported. 23 new cases of the coronavirus were confirmed here in Caldwell County yesterday, increasing the overall total to 277. There have been four COVID-19 associated deaths in Caldwell. At least 134 patients had recovered. And as of Wednesday, five people remained hospitalized with the coronavirus. Just under 5% of the people tested for COVID-19 here in Caldwell County have been positive for the virus. In addition to that 19th death that we told you about, Burke County Public Health confirmed eight new cases of COVID-19 yesterday, increasing the total to 842, the highest number in the Hickory Metro. The cases consist of traveling, congregate living, and community spread. All positive cases are isolated and public health staff continues to investigate the cases and will be locating those close contacts to help contain the spread of the infection. Alexander County Public Health issued two COVID-19 updates yesterday. They confirmed seven new cases of the coronavirus overall Wednesday, increasing the total in the county to 57 with no deaths. 40 of the 57 people who had contracted COVID-19 in Alexander County had fully recovered. At the end of the day Wednesday, there were 15 active cases under quarantine and two in the hospital. Alexander County officials are continuing to encourage citizens to use social distancing, wash hands regularly, use hand sanitizer and face coverings. For the latest Catawba County numbers, stick around. Ralph Mangum will have them following this report. Reporting from Caldwell County, I'm Rob Eastwood, WHKY-TV News. Back to you.